So how's your shift coming along? It's fine. Thanks for asking. Shane, do you have any chicken stories for me? I'm doomed. Oh, looks like Clint likes Emily. Oh, hello, friend snack here and welcome back to Hello Farm. As you can see, today is going to be the first day of winter and although our crops are, you know, already gone, it's just part of it. Kind of sad, but I'm so happy. This is actually one of the my, my most favorite season. IRL. Unfortunately, we fainted last night and we've paid Joja 800 gold. And our coop has been upgraded. Awesome. So now time to repair. No, not, not repair, but it's going to be an awesome uh, opportunity for us to mine, fish, forage, upgrade some uh, tools, maybe upgrade our building in preparation for spring. But now we'll enjoy the things that we can do in winter. So I I'm, I'm can't wait to do fishing because I haven't really fished a lot hello chickens yeah i always want to talk to my farm friends oh wait should i set them free if it's winter uh, i'm not sure maybe it's fine right hello cow friends so what was i saying again oh, i forgot man this reminds me of looking for my car key for almost a whole day only to end up that it's already in my pocket <laughs> looks like they don't like outside chickens chickens are not going out let's just close them and uh at least we have two eggs in our mayo machine and uh yes yeah, so we're gonna buy a lot of chickens man a lot of them so like i said there are a lot of fun things that we can do but uh, more importantly uh, aside from uh, those things we need to prepare for spring so um hoping that we could upgrade all our the hoe and the scythe and also the watering can to at least copper and if you look at the upper left hand uh, corner uh, we have a goal which is to expand a coop which we've already done uh, next is the barn we're gonna be expanding it and hopefully we could expand a kitchen and uh, build a stable. And unfortunately, guys, if you look at this, we haven't really worked uh, much in our community center. So the greenhouse is going to wait. But I'm glad we still have these mushrooms up and running. One of our money makers for a winter. Look at that. I've stored all our mushrooms. I haven't sold them yet. So if you look at the lower right hand corner, um, we already only at there of 30 percent health or stamina which is not that great so in this case uh we'll have to prioritize we're gonna go fishing here by the river and after that uh we'll see if we could do some foraging hey bird oh look at this <laughs> a crook this is gonna go straight in our uh winter foraging bundle we have a book found awesome and the main reason why, why i like uh winter is the if you hear now the sound, the music, it really uh, brings me to a to this happy place where it's only me doing some fishing, enjoying my time without any wor worries. Okay, we have a bait for a bite. By the way, guys, again, thank you so much for hanging out. And uh, if you are new here, feel free to like and subscribe to help our community grow. Also, for more um, videos like this, because I'm also planning to uh, play this new game that just exploded, man. Yeah, you guess it right. I think you've heard about it. It's Pal World. <laughs> it's kind of it's kind of a controversial game because you know it's like Pokemon with guns and all those um, stuff. However, I played it, and there are elements that you know that does that. However, um, it's balanced. Like for example, you let your pile work for you, but you have to provide bed for them, give them a nice hot, hot spring so they can rest. And uh, it's not really in slavery. Oh wait, this, uh, this, uh, okay, okay, let me just focus on this fish. So uh, again, it's not actually, uh, oh wait, wait, I can't, I can't talk for this. Uh, no, we lost it. Again, for me, as my own opinion, it's not in slavery if you let someone rest and take their time to go back to work. <laughs> so uh, I would like to try it out in this channel, guys. In fact, I already have a video uploaded, one video about it. It was just, you know, to test it out. Oh, I think this is the same fish. Hold on. No, oh, this is so hard, man. This fish is so unpredictable. Okay, we'll just let it go. It's a waste of time. And by the way, guys, I would like just to share um, some cool things about what i just read this early morning because i was actually struggling uh at work because there are things there are some elements oh my gosh just like this we're struggling right now so IRL, there are elements that you know that is really not within our control so what i learned is that um we don't have to resist those elements we just have to do good things that's how we conquer them 
So that's what I'm gonna test in my life starting now. Hopefully I won't forget and uh, I'll have to meditate on that and pray to the Lord Jesus Christ to remind me and give me the power to execute it properly. Oh geez, it's 3.30 or almost 4 p.m. One more fish and then after this we're gonna go forage and say hi to the town folks. And uh, yeah, we have a book but uh, the library is gonna be closed. Oh, I don't think so we can get it. This is the, I think this is gonna be the same fish. Hold on, hold on. Oh, we got it, man. It's a oh, tiger trout. Okay. Okay. Uh, maybe a uh, last two fish. Okay, last one. Now we're exhausted. All right, we have a hit. Mm -hmm. Awesome, a perch. All right. Thank you, Valley, for these fresh, delicious fish. So we got a golden perch, a chub, another perch, and a tiger trout. And a silver chub. Okay. Hey, guys, look at these fish right here. <laughs> They're so happy swimming. We also have a wormly and we found an ornamental fan. Awesome. If we look at the lower left hand corner, we almost fainted. <laughs> I forgot. We don't have stamina left. Oh, well, it's 6 p.m. We could say hi to our friends at the saloon. No, oh, hold on. Leia, we need to say hi to her. Hey, no, it's closed. It's closed. Hey, we have here an awesome Christmas tree. Nice. Perfect for winter. Hey, we have a cutscene here. It's it's Clint's cutscene. All right, let's see. Mm -hmm. Hello, Snacku. Care to join me? Sure, Clint. Let me just go ahead and tell you what's on my mind. He's kind of annoyed, I think. I feel terrible luck with a woman. <laughs> Snacku sigh. Oh, I don't think if I'm the right person to be asked. Anyway, I'll try my best. I'm a nice guy if you get to know me. I swear. <laughs> the girls all seem to like you. <laughs> well, I don't think that way. Got any tips? Impress women with your strength and charm. <laughs> this is actually uh, Clint's strength because he's a blacksmith. But the charm, I don't know. Uh, all the best advice I could give you is to act natural and be yourself. Because that's the only way you'll find uh, someone that who will accept you for who you are and grow with that person for a lifetime that's the problem i do act natural but i never have any success okay looks like uh, we have emily barging in hi clint what can i get for you tonight yes sir i mean i'll have the big and cheesy with extra sauce please hi sniku hello emily er, ahem. thanks emily for taking my order emily i was <laughs> I was wondering. Yes, Clint? Never mind. <laughs> Looks like Clint don't have the courage yet to, you know, to be himself in front of the person he likes. Mm, we have here Shane. Hi, Shane. Here's your beverage. Thank you, Emily. So how's your shift coming along? It's fine. Thanks for asking. Shane, do you have any chicken stories for me? I'm doomed. Oh, looks like Clint likes Emily. No, we're not letting Shane have Emily. Let me correct myself because we need to help our buddy here, Clint. So we'll just give everyone this gift. Blackberry. Seems everyone likes it so much except for children, I guess. Even Shane likes blackberries. All right, done with that. Now let's head straight to where? It's like uh, 9 p.m. now. We don't have stamina left. If you look at the lower right hand corner, let's just check out the bulletin board. Oh, it's going to be Linus's birthday two days from now. All right, we have a uh, holy. What does this do? Oh, it it the leaves in bright red berries make a popular winter decoration. It's not food, it's a decoration. <laughs> oh, awesome guys, look at this. Our blackberry jelly is totally prepared. Let's refill these reserve jars. And also two of our mayonnaise is ready. Awesome, we have now 50 to 25 blackberry jelly costs 2000 gold. So we're just gonna go ahead and sell these stuff. Ghost fish, uh, no, it's hard to look for this ghost, ghost fish. We're gonna keep it. All right, we are done with the inventory. We've already collected our preserve jars and refilled them or the blackberry has been collected and refilled the preserve jars and also the mayonnaise now uh, what did i say about the about clint well i'm totally not you know a pro when it comes to relationship but what i learned from my mistakes is that uh yeah you just have to be yourself while you know being uh and not thinking about at the same time not thinking about yourself always think about others all the time is you can be yourself and not think of others right and that's gonna be a disaster so oh we have a wood here nice one wood from the branch so i guess it's a start be yourself but think first of others before yourself yeah that's gonna be our takeaway for today good night everyone good night and we have leveled up our farming level nine we now finally have a seed maker and a radium sprinkler and a quality fertilizer haha <laughs> and we made like uh five or seven hundred gold from the first day of winter that's that's cool welcome to the second day
So tomorrow is gonna snow and uh, the spirits are annoyed today. Oh, hold on. Just wanted to let you know about a new item I'm carrying. It's called a wood chipper. You can use it to break hard wood into several pieces of regular wood. Oh, I see. I know wood can be hard to come by in the winter. So if you supply gets low. Okay, sure. That's a very handy tool. So Willy has a challenge for us for us to catch a squid so we can fish him from the ocean at night and they only show up in winter. All right, cool, cool. We'll go ahead and take on that challenge since we really don't have that much to do. And we're gonna use this wild bait. Uh -huh. Hello, thank you. How you doing? Hope you're not cold. Hello, my friends. Oh, I forgot we need to buy. We need to buy chicken from Marnie. We're just gonna store first our eggs. Hello, my Yamangas friends. Awesome, we're done with the farm chores. We have 9,000 gold, it's 7 a.m. We do have full stamina at the lower right hand corner. Uh, since we're gonna be waiting for Marnie to open, let's just head straight in the forest, check for some forageables, and maybe fish a little until Marnie opens up at 9. I think 9 a.m. Well, yeah. I'll just take a walk and grab this holy. Say hi to this Wrigley. Stick him up. And we found a snow yam. Nice. We have another one. We found a clay and a warp totem toward the mountains. Oh, winter, winter. It makes me feel happy, but at the same time, lonely. I think we need to find a wife, right? Maybe we'll, we'll work on that. Since we've already have like a... We're getting close with uh, Leah and Abigail. <laughs> we might need to... Hello, birds. Yeah, we might need to expand our family. But before doing so, at least we'll, we'll expand our home, right? At least it will have a kitchen for, for us to... Oh, man. Yeah, for us to cook for Leah or Abigail. I don't know whom to choose yet. So we have here a crab pot, but you know, it's never working. Ah, I know, I know. I think we need to put a bait in this crab pot that oh yeah there you go i just put a bait it's a wild bait uh i will just put something here not a wild bait i used the mouse that's what i was missing man i was thinking why these crab pots are not working the thing is we need to put a bait <laughs> crazy huh all right there you go what a newbie mistake that's the fun of it oh marnie hey where are you going Oh man. You know what? What you're doing, Marnie, is bad for business. You're always not in your home. And it looks like we have a new task here. Let's choose. All right. Actually, since we're planning of fishing, we'll go ahead with this. Um, for unknown reasons, the local population of ocean fish has grown to an unsustainable level. I need a local angler to help reduce. Yes, absolutely. I'd be happy to help. Uh, for, before we go to the ocean we'll just uh, drop this ornament to gunther hello gunther how you doing i don't know why gunther don't have expression at all and also we cannot say hi to him maybe he's a robot what well, that's what i suspect see we can't go let's just say hi to everyone here hello i'm looking forward to seeing what your farm looks like in the spring <laughs> thank you so much so i'm just taking some screenshots right now that we could use for a thumbnail in the future and look at that guys we have a lot of books here oh looks like we can build a keg put uh vegetable to create juice a wheat to create beer hop for a pale ale and uh root for a wine okay wait hold on dwarves take what they need from our houses oh it's kind of weird ah, all right since i'm planning to marry someone looks like we need to buy a bouquet from perry so we could ask them for a date all right and when you're ready for the big question you'll need to give them a mermaid's pendant okay but it's rumored that on stormy days the ghost of an old mariner appears in Stardew Valley clutching just such pendants. So after that, uh, your partner will move with you, uh, but remember to treat your spouse well. <laughs> They'll still take gifts even after marriage. That's nice. So I wonder if we could date two ladies at the same time because I'm planning to, you know, date uh, Leia and Abigail. Okay, why not? Let's go ahead and buy uh, two bouquets at Paris Place and uh, see what will happen if we buy or date two at the same time <laughs> it's gonna be fun and uh leia likes jojo cola just to rub on my sore ear that's weird what could happen to her we should say hi and check her out make sure she's doing fine sore ear what happened okay uh oh we can actually upgrade our bag but that's gonna be too much Ten thousand gold a bouquet there oh 200 <laughs> let's buy two bouquets awesome and looks like our lovely ladies here are having fun marnie is at it <laughs> marnie smiles at you through a mist of sweat <laughs> all right see you ladies and we have need a jojo cola 
maybe we could buy it of course in the Georgia market. It's gonna be the first time we'll be visiting this place. You will your life, Georgia Cola. Just one for my friend Leia. We have one more crocus. It's still 3 p.m. But we need to visit the ocean at night so we could catch those squid. Oh, oh I almost forgot. I need to buy a, a fish trout to help us with that. And also um, do some foraging along the way. We have this here. I will just pick it up after buying a fish trout before this guy closes. Hey, Willie, I'll just buy three. Awesome. Oh, this is a strange a shell. Now tell us a shell. If you look at the lower left hand corner and we have here some corals. Now, the funny thing is that I don't have enough space for our fish. Uh, we might need to sell them as soon as we can. Hopefully, Willie's still open. Otherwise, we're going to run straight into our farm and ship them in the shipping bin. Unfortunately, Willie's close. Hey, Willie, I was supposed to sell you something real cool, but... Oh boy, this holy actually cost 80 gold. Uh, we'll just sell them. And we'll also sell this shell. It's 150 gold, man. That's very profitable. And now let's head straight to uh, the ocean to catch some squid. Because again, Willie has uh, challenged us to catch a squid. So we'll see. And I'm also interested since... Squids are only available during winter, so we'll just take advantage of it. Is they sell expensively at uh, spring, right? Since, you know, there's going to be a high demand of squid. We'll see to it. We'll just have to compare the prices. Mm, right, we are here. Oopsie. There we go. We have a stone. Okay, there's going to be a perfect spot. Look at that. We have a squid here. Right away. There's a squid. There's a squid. Aha. Uh -huh. Nice. I forgot to... Eat our fish trouts. Oh, there you go. We have an halibut. All right, we got two fishes. Looks like the wild bait really worked. The wild bait that was, you know, the recipe was given by Linus. The wild bait lets us fish. There's a chance of fishing two fishes in one. We have a Jojo Cola. That reminds me that we need to give Jojo Cola to Leia. Oh boy. Okay, I think this one is a squid. Hopefully we could catch this. Awesome. And uh, no, but an albacore. That's nice. Oh, I'm pretty sure this is a squid, man. It's so jumpy. But I don't have that much scale. Looks like we need to drink or to eat up a... Uh, wait, hold on. A trout. A trout suit. All right, we, this should help us catch that squid. Okay, this is a squid indeed. Okay, I think that the soup is working. Just one squid, man. Come on. Just one. Just one squid. Oh, we're so close. All right. There you go. <laughs> we got a squid. Challenge has been conquered. Looks like it's getting late. It's going to be our last catch for the night. If we can, because it looks like this is going to be another squid. And you know, squids are very squidly. They jump all over the place. And there you go. Oh, it's an albacore. All right, let's head straight to bed. I don't want to, you know, to be found by Joja again and pay them a huge amount of money to do a good thing for a person. That's crazy, right? Like, hey, in order for me to save you and to do good, I, you need to pay me. It's just totally ridiculous. So it looks like we forgot to give Leah a uh, Joja Cola, but we still have two days. That's fine. So now um, we need only like... Uh, seven fish to catch to complete a dimitri's request and we got like an halibut golden herring golden albacore these guys here from that uh fishing adventure we also got this copper along the way awesome oh man it's almost like we're about to faint and uh yes guys for more videos you can look at the lower left hand corner thanks again for hanging out and if you're new again please feel free to like and subscribe don't forget to be patient and kind to another it looks like we just fainted be patient to yourself as well be kind to one another so you won't see so we won't faint like that <laughs> see you in the next video